everyone, welcome to my channel. So most of you that clicked on this video know who I'm going to be talking about, but a lot of you don't. So let's just start at the beginning. So did you guys know that there's a huge YouTube community that is being paid to eat? And if you search mukbang, that's how you spell it. I know most of us know, but a lot of people actually probably don't know about this. So search that and you're going to see endless amount of videos, uh, people making videos just to watch them eat. And it's usually very large quantities of food, huge amounts of food. And it goes on and on and on. So the reason why I'm showing you this and the reason why I'm featuring Amberlynn Reed is because she started her channel years ago as a weight loss channel. And now she's 600 pounds. So these videos got really, really popular just a few years ago. And they get a lot of views. Let me search this by the most viewed and I'm going to show you guys. Okay, so take a look at these views. This one has 29 million views in. I'm probably going to watch it out of curiosity. So here's a lot more. So they get a lot of views. And um, they get paid a lot of money. A lot of money. The person that I'm going to speak about in just a minute, Amberlynn Reed, um, I estimate, and she actually said, that she gets around $10,000 a month by YouTube paid by YouTube to eat. So do you see all these? I mean, there's there's a lot of videos for a reason because they're popular and people are getting paid to do this. So just a question. If you got paid $10,000 a month, would you do this? Would you eat massive amounts of food on YouTube if you got paid $10,000 a month. And that's the low estimate. That's that's on the low side. Some of these people get paid a lot more. So do you see? That word is in all the titles because they know it's going to get the views. So you guys can go ahead and search that. Um, but now, let me show you guys Amberlynn Reed when she started her weight loss channel, how much she weighed, what she looked like, and I'm going to show you what she looks like now. Well, this is Amberlynn Reed's channel, and so I sorted it from the oldest videos. So let's take a look at her very first video. Hi, um, my name's Amberlynn, and I wanted to start um a youtube channel for weight loss i see a lot of videos of other people doing it and it's so motivating and it's just something i'm really really interested in doing um i'm not even sure what to say i guess it's just this can be like a little introduction um so my name is amber lynn i'm 22 years old um it's sunday right now and Today was nothing but eating horrible. Um, <clears throat> I've been on a weight loss, weight loss journey for a very, very long time now. Um, last time I weighed in was, I think about a week ago, I was at 368 or something like that. Um, I'm probably a little higher now. I'll be weighing in tomorrow, and I can make a video stating my way in. Okay, so let's just stop right there. So basically, she's introducing herself. I think she said she weighs 368. She already has a weight problem, but she wants to start a weight loss channel to hold herself accountable and to be an inspiration to other people. So, um, this was five years ago, and you guys know the type of videos that I showed you in the beginning, the mukbang videos? Well, they got really, really popular on YouTube. 
When Amberlynn Reed first started her channel, she was making zero. She was making no money whatsoever. But when these videos got popular, she started getting all kinds of views and all kinds of money. Let's take a look at her mukbang videos, and I'm going to show you guys what she looks like now. So I sorted her videos by the most viewed. So her most viewed videos are the ones of her eating a massive amount of food. So for somebody that already has a weight problem and weight issues, she was 497 there. I bet she wishes she was 497 now. So she's 600 pounds now. I'll show you what she looks like in just a second. But uh, what I'm saying is that YouTube has a lot of rules and they're really strict about a lot of things but they're still paying these people to eat massive amounts of food. So that's their motivation. I mean, okay, if they make one video just telling you, oh, I really want to lose weight, and that video gets um, 10,000 views, and then they make another video eating a massive amount of food, and it gets 500,000 views, that's going to be so much motivation and inspiration to keep doing these videos. So look at some of her videos. A lot of them. And she's done so many. And look, she'll even, she will even make thumbnails like this because she knows people, well, it's two-sided. They love to leave the hate comments, but they sure will watch the video. So she does this just to antagonize people. I mean, they don't want to see that, and she's going to get a lot of hate for that. But she will continue to make videos like this, thumbnails like this. See? I mean, that is going to trigger a lot of people. A 600-pound person stuffing their face, right? Isn't it? But she's still making money, so she don't care. She doesn't care who she's making mad. There's that one. So that's the majority of the videos on her channel is eating. Ever since these videos got popular. And people will watch. So this is what she looks like. Like um oh that was two years ago. No, she's much she's smaller there. So let's take a look at what she looks like now. And by the way, she can hardly walk. I think the last time um she spoke about this, she's able to walk about two minutes. She's able to walk about two minutes. She's bedridden most of the time. And she's having some uh, major health problems. Let's take a look. Looks like now. Do you remember the first video that I showed you guys where she's introducing herself and she's 397? Well, she's 600 pounds now, at least. And this is what she looks like now. And she's having a lot of health problems. But what do you guys think? Do you think... This is her full body shot there and right there too. Um, so do you think that um, these videos should be monetized? Should these people with such problems be able to make money off this type of content? You guys would have to know how YouTube is, how strict they are with rules. I'm really surprised that they are still allowing ads and people to be paid to make this kind of content. Um, there's not supposed to be any offensive, any... Now, let me give you guys an example. So they can get paid to eat massive amounts of food and get fatter and fatter and fatter. But more than likely, my video right here just talking about it will not get monetized because this is a sensitive subject. So they are allowed to do it. They're allowed to eat massive amounts of food and literally gain hundreds of pounds before your eyes. But I am not allowed to talk about it because it's not appropriate. And it's a sensitive subject. And that's how strict YouTube is. But it really doesn't make any sense. There's so many rules, so many guidelines that just at this point make no sense whatsoever. But the main point of my video is, I really do think that YouTube contributed 
to her massive weight gain. And I also think all of the hate comments and all of the negative comments that she gets and all of the views that she gets on these eating videos have also contributed. Because if you guys were watching, she wouldn't be getting paid. Well, she said she made $10,000 a month, and that was when she had about um, 118,000 subscribers. So the money's growing, and so is she. So she has probably the most negative comments on any channel I've ever seen. Let me show you guys what people say to her. So keep in mind, this is a video. She's just telling everybody that she had to go to the emergency room. So, how many views? It was 60,000. So 69,000 views. Let's see how many comments. Almost 4,000 comments. So all these people watch this video and are putting money in her pocket. But let's see what they had to say. So, 1,400 likes, really? So, a lot of people are frustrated because they've been watching her for years, and they were at one time rooting for her, I get that, but why still watch? Why still watch just to know that you're going to leave a negative comment? You know, she frustrates you that bad, and you dislike her that bad why watch you know i feel bad for her i still watch her channel it's still an interesting channel i'm curious as to what's going to happen to her actually but i don't leave her negative comments yep more negative comments so um to my subscribers or people who didn't know about this did you guys know that there's a whole community that is getting paid to eat on youtube just search it. You you won't believe it. You won't believe the massive amounts of food that these people are eating. And the incentive is a lot of money. And some of the comments are just plain mean-spirited, as you can see. Well, anyway, um, if you guys want to check out her channel, I will leave the link down below. Let me know what you guys think. But I do believe that YouTube um, paying her and all these people watching her videos are contributing to her massive weight gain. Let me know what you guys think. Uh, leave me a comment down below. Thanks for watching.